Wow. All right, so this is it. <laughs> I'm kidding. I just got so much motivation to film. I just uploaded on my main channel for the first time in over a year, I think. Goddamn, guys, it's been quite the whirlwind. I will share in this video what I've been through and everything that has happened to me as much as I possibly can with like sharing out, you know, the nitty ditty great details and stuff because I don't know if you guys want to know all of that. But I am single and ready to mingle. <laughs> no, but I am on my own now. I have Bella and we are just living our best lives now. So yeah, now I'm, I'm just wondering what my future holds and what I have in store for me and what's next and what's to come. And I'm excited to share that with you guys and travel vlogs and all that stuff. I know that I have a lot of vlogs from Singapore that I just went to um, not that long ago. So I think I'm gonna share those on this channel. Um, and I'm gonna try and post some more beatbox videos on the other channel and singing videos too, because I feel like a lot of people have been requesting beatboxing videos, singing videos, all of the above, and I haven't done it. And also, well, I don't know about the vlog channel, but <laughs> I'm gonna vlog anyways, because I love to vlog my life. And yeah, I've missed YouTube so much. I've been through, I think, 2023, well, 2022 and 2023 has been probably the hardest years of my entire life. My 31 years on this planet has been definitely the hardest. I've been through hell and back, to say the least. Um, I don't know if I want to share those details really with you guys. I don't know if I want to go too much into it, but needless to say I hope that no no not that I hope I know that from now on out my life is going to be amazing and spectacular and I want you guys to kind of follow me on my journey of actually following my dreams and my passion because I put that on a side burner for someone else someone else's dreams and yeah I'm not second anymore and I hope you guys can see that and I'm finally focusing on what I really well, truly feel like I was meant to do um and why I was placed on this earth to do so yeah so that's gonna be kind of like my little intro for you guys I will share all of my like travel experiences and if you guys have any um any suggestions just comment them down below and I will do as much as I possibly can I'm gonna try and sorry for the mess in the background <laughs> I am gonna try and vlog as much as I can on this whole new journey of singledom and just re-exploring myself and loving myself again and being alone for the first time in god i want to say this is the first time i've been alone for yeah the first time in 15 years <laughs> which is crazy to me um i've always been in a relationship long-term relationships um and i just got out of my second longest relationship that was six years and yeah, it's all new to me, but I'm finally over the crying and sad phase and I'm more like it's for the best and yeah, I'm just going to better myself and focus on myself and become a better person and do, like I said, focus on my dreams and do what I wanted to do this entire time while I was in that relationship. Um, so yeah, so if you guys have any suggestions, leave them down below. I will share some of my experience of when I traveled. I traveled to Florida when I first, you know, got out of the relationship to kind of do some little like soul searching and just kind of heal or start the journey to healing anyways. Um, I don't know if I did heal, but <laughs> I still think I'm in the process of healing. As you guys can imagine, you know, breakups are like the worst thing. And the breakup that I just went through, um, not only did I lose a partner, I lost a best friend, I lost a daughter because I did raise I would like to say I raised a daughter from when she was six months old to now she's six years old. Um, my dog, Giovanni, that I left as well. Um, my company, all of that. So whatever, too many details. But, <laughs> but needless to say, I went on a soul searching journey and I started with Florida first. And then I went to Singapore and then I went to New Brunswick and then I'm back. <laughs> back in, in Montreal, in Canada, my motherland. Um, <clears throat> whether or not I'm going to stay here, I don't know. You guys will have to follow along to see what happens. I'm not entirely sure what I'm going to do yet, but I'm just 
very hopeful for my future. And someone's knocking at my door. Gotta go. I'll see you later.